All right, here we go. <clears throat> yep, we're going into it. It's happening more and more and more, going into a tipping point. Some big things are going to be happening here shortly. I have a very important message. I actually had a predictive dream. I really hesitated to share it because I wanted to make sure I interpreted it correctly. I believe I did. I haven't had one of these in ages. I've written down and recorded my dreams in advance and and they are always foretelling of something. Now I'm going to share this with you because I think it's really good news. We're going to have coffee together. I've got my hat on today. It's a hat kind of day. And we're going to talk about the massive shift into the new earth, my predictive dream that I think you're going to love. It's all good. Let's go. Welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube, here to help you break through those fears and live an amazing life. I have a five-star course called Breakthrough Fear. Have you taken it? It's changed people's lives. Why? How can a life change by taking a course? A mind shift. Seeing the world differently. And that's all we have to do is we're going to go through some massive changes. Get ready. Put on your seatbelt. We're going into it right now. However, how we see it and how we handle and react to everything is going to determine where we go in our frequency in the matrix game that we're playing. We can either create heaven on earth or the other. So it's all part of the game. Now let me share something with you. I have had dreams in the past. I've had a lot of prophetic dreams. I've written them down and shot videos in advance so that when they happen, it's not like, hey, I had that dream. No, I'm going to show you right now that we have what I call probability predictions. Now, in the past, I had very strong dreams about flooding, a lot of dreams. But in the dreams, I was warning people, and the flood actually did happen. And we were getting on school buses to get out of cities. I had details about that. I've had predictions about plane crashes right down to how many, what the plane looked like, how many people on board died, uh, with the circumstances of it. I've had all kinds of bizarre premonitions with details and found them in the news within one or two days. Now, I had one of those dreams, and I haven't had one in quite some time. And the dream was about factions taking sides dealing with weapons and also a uh, natural disaster, in particular earthquake, was the subject matter of the dream. Now here's the good news about this. In these dreams we were set up for it. In fact I saw us set up for it and I was preparing and they didn't happen. And I kept waiting for it to happen. I had no fear. I was prepared for it, but I realized it wasn't happening. No one actually followed through on the conflict, and the earthquake never happened. When I woke up, I really couldn't understand what that dream was about. So if we didn't have that conflict going on, with the earthquake didn't actually happen in the dream, what was that about? I believe we are in alignment with great nexus points right now, turning points, and I believe that we are accomplishing amazing feats of going into higher frequencies that can avert some of these things. Some things we're destined to experience because it's going to create and facilitate massive positive change or negative if we choose it. We have free will. I see us going into positive change. Now if you saw my survey that I do to the community on my channel, uh, I asked everybody, this went out to the public, do you think we are in for an amazing new great awakening, a new era, or do you think that we're going to, you know, hell in a handbasket? Only four people thought, four percent thought we were going to hell in a handbasket. Three quarters 
of the people believed that we were going into an exciting new golden era. Now here's what's so exciting about that. Those thoughts alone create it. Whatever we have that's a probability that might be sitting there ready to go can be changed. The nexus point is these probabilities ready to go that we created all this cause and effect to this point ready to go does not have to occur. We can take different paths. All right, that's what this is. Which path are we going to take? I hope that you'll subscribe and share these because the more we understand that we are actually creating that with our thoughts, the more we can change the planet. Now, what does that dream mean? It means that we are going into an amazing new shift and that you and I are totally in control of that. When you go into peace and you realize, here we go, put on your seatbelt, we're going to go into an era where all things are possible and I am really in control of that. If you're in my Manifest Anything series, you know that I just launched Total Clarity. Total Clarity is when you know your power and you know how to use it. And you have to be clear on that because if you think there's an outside force that you have no power over, then you become disempowered through choice. Now what's going to happen is some, if you can't control other people or what they choose, but you can control how you react to that and your thoughts about it. And through that you do affect them because we are all connected, we're all one. This is why even natural disasters can shift and change through our thoughts. She's reacting to us. So just like we all got, you know, our little illness, well, she's becoming ill because of what we're doing to her because we are all interacting. Nothing stands alone. When we clean that up, and we are doing it, it's going to take a while, but we're doing it. Through our thoughts, our actions, and everything we do, our world's going to shift. So whatever's coming, I want you to know, it's not to fear. It's the change that's necessary. It's going to take us into a new world where we don't have market crashes every 10 years, or starvation, or abuse, or all the things that are happening now where we're frustrated with and we're pointing fingers, but the question is, what are we doing about it? So it starts with our thoughts and not anger or opposition. And I saw that in my predictive dream, that we act, the guns never fired, and the earthquake never happened. And I thought, we're sitting here waiting to see what the world's going to do with these probabilities. My miracle circle is when we get together, and you can start doing this today, we get together online. I host this once a month. You get training on my website, and then once a month we do a live circle, and we see the planet as perfect. We send blessings. We send our love. We see great change. We call upon all of the help that we have available to us to make this happen because there's not a coincidence that you, of seven billion people in an infinite universe, are here. That wasn't just random. And all of your experiences we signed up for because how we handle those experiences determines how we change the world. So if you have gone through abuse, you can be the person that helps change that. But you had to experience that in order to know what that is and how horrible it can be and how dense it can be so you can look at the root and the foundation of these problems and find solutions. How do we stop the perpetrators? What's going on in their lives that pushed them to do that? Many times they have been abused. So it perpetuates when we just punish without understanding that there's something deeper. We're finding solutions, and I want you to know that as we move into these probabilities, you still have control to change any situation that starts with your own life. There is nothing happening in your life that you cannot change, and how you see it is the first step. How do I see my life? And if I see this as an opportunity for positive change, 
then I can shift into a completely different mindset that creates a different reality. And then you don't see the bad thing about it you, or punishment. You see the opportunity. Everything, every challenge is a teaching. Will we use our global challenge to come together or will we continue to battle it? There's some things going on that are just not right. However, we as a community can say, how do we change this and come together and say, you know what? We have to create a different world where we are working together and still having our individual choices. So I call upon you to go into that higher frequency so that these probabilities will not come to pass and some of the things that we are going to go through that you will not see them as punishment or negative or that it's the end of the world. It's not. It's the end of a world that hasn't worked. It's the end of density. And there will be some that continue to choose that. And okay, that is their individual choices. But you do not have to participate in that. Everything you focus on, everything, it could be one show, it could be one media broadcast, it could be one blog. Everything you focus on is creating. So even if you oppose it, you're still fueling what you're viewing. It becomes real because you focused on it. So put on your seatbelt. Yes, we're going into a massive shift. It's getting closer and closer to the tipping point. 2022 is the year of action and the reason I say this, it's time for us to get off the couch and stop talking about all these things and start doing something about it without all of the violence or pushing our own agenda on anybody else because we can respect one another and there's a way to do that. So we have thousands of people doing things like this. This is a free video series. What is that? We're creating businesses. We're using the internet to reach the globe. We're sending messages that are positive. We are creating products and services that don't mess up our planet. We're coming together as communities from all over the globe in Zoom meetings and, and getting training and getting new skills to give ourselves options to live other lives. Uh, please subscribe, share these videos everywhere you want, and go down in the description, come over and get Manifest Anything. It's free, and I'm, it's a brand new sp spanking uh, video series where I take you through getting total clarity, breaking through the fears, and activating your magic. There is a process, and we have to let a lot of things go. So are you ready to do that with me? Because that dream was actually so positive, I realized it never happened. It's a nexus point. What are you going to choose? Are you ready for it? I guarantee you, you have some control over this. I promise you that whatever you're thinking, believing, doing has a profound effect on this collective consciousness in this matrix that we're playing out. And whatever happens here will determine what happens next in your next adventure. So there's never anything to fear. Learn from everything. Find the compassion in your heart for others. You're absolutely amazing and you're beautiful. Go easy on yourself and just watch those thoughts and realizing that thought is creating. What am I manifesting? You guys, when you come over to Manifest Anything, you get a free mobile app so that you can watch that every second. So my prediction is that all these things are aligned and we are able to change them. We do not have to follow through with them. Are you ready for that? Are you ready to go into a new world, a new era? Fasten your seatbelts because what's not working will start to dissolve in a very big way. Celebrate it and be the positive change. Send our planet light and love every day and know that every person you see is a light being, amazing, and so are you. You're whole and perfect, strong and powerful, loving, harmonious and happy. Blessings to you, my friend. Namaste.